Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do lower thirds in Camtasia 9. All right guys, so I'm here in Camtasia 9 and I've already got like a clip on the screen as a test. And the cool thing about Camtasia 9 is they have a bunch of lower third templates that you can use and they look really professional and really cool. So how you add this to your videos is, you know, when you have your video on there and you're done and you're ready to go, you head over to library and you'll see there's like a list of a bunch of things and then you'll see motion graphics lower thirds. So we're going to click on this triangle thing and open that and they're going to have about seven lower third examples that you can use on your videos. So when you're ready to use one, you basically just click on it and drag it down to the timeline. So let's say I want to use sliding boxes here and I'm going to click on it and drag it down above the video because if you put it below you're not going to see it. Alright so when I first dragged it on it was a little bit too big so as you can see there's only part of it showing so I'm just going to drag it and move it over and I'm just gonna make it a little bit smaller because I feel it's a little bit too big so I'm just gonna alter that and this looks good here so if you don't know already, lower thirds is like a little thing that pops up on the screen and it usually says your name and your title um, in the beginning of the video. And you can put anything you want on there if you want people to follow you or click the thumbs up, but generally you put your name on that. So I'm going to click play. Super, super expensive. Now you can purchase within the US. So that actually makes your video look really professional when you have like a little lower thirds thing pop up at the bottom. So obviously you've got it on there, but it says TechSmith, TechSmith Camtasia and Camtasia. Obviously you don't want that information on there. You want your information. So what you wanna do is you wanna click on the plus sign on the example, the template that you just dragged down. So you're gonna click the plus sign and then when you scroll a little bit up, you're gonna see like what makes this lower third template and you're gonna alter each piece. So when you click on the top one here, that's gonna alter that red part. So let's say for this section, I'm gonna put our like channel name and then click over here and then I'm gonna put my name now in this section here well they had it all capitals I like that all capitals let's just do that jewel okay and you can shape things accordingly so you can move this move it to the center have it aligned you can change the color of it, you can change the font, or you can leave it as is. And then the last one here at the bottom, let's alter, oh, let's open that, it closed up on me. Let's open this one and then double click to alter that. And then dare to be dream driven. So that's what I wanted to say on there. So. That looks really cool. It's got my name, it's got my channel name or business name, and then like our little phrase that we say to everyone. So let's play that back and see what it looks like. Super, super expensive. Now you can purchase within the US and have a... Uh... So that looks really cool and really professional. So that is the example of the sliding boxes one. But again, there's seven different kinds. So there's like basic text, uh, basic a third one, uh, circle ripple, electric box, shimmer, squares, and rectangles. So you'll have to play around with them and check out which one you like the best and alter it you know, with your name and your title. So that is how you add lower thirds to your videos. Again, you hit up library, 
go down to the lower thirds section and check out the templates, drag it down, and then edit within there your name and your titles. All right, guys, well, that was it for this video. If I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or a subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. And if you like these types of videos, head down to the description below as I have much more free Camtasia 9 tutorials for you guys. All right, guys, well, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Back from the dead.